you into my life or whatever. Forever, feeling like you could do better, better than me. I'm wishing OT, wishing you stay. Guys, make sure you check out MuleFactory.com, link in the description, and use Owen FIFA for 5% off, guys. They sell coins and lots of other different games as well, such as like League of Legends, RuneScape, etc. Loads of different stuff for every game that you guys will be playing. Use Owen FIFA for 5% off, guys. It's quick and reliable, very easy, and they do cover the 5% EA tax. Hey guys, welcome back to today and welcome back to a brand new video. I tried to show you my trade profit to start this one off and we are actually now up to around 10 million, I think, something like that. Let's have a look here. Yeah, ex no, exactly 10 million really. I did check that just before, I'm not going to lie. But yeah, um, not bad at all. 10 mil trade profit now because I still have my tea and then a few investments and whatever. But this video is going to be my top 5 uh, trading methods from this month, uh, obviously January now in the new year. So we normally do this around the midpoint of the year. It's a little bit early this year so I want to get out before Team of the Year so you guys can have these methods for Team of the Year. Um, the video is all going to Team of the Year theme very soon guys so make sure you look out for that. It may change into packs every now and again and whatever. I don't know what you want, uh, whether you want like say packs one day, like maybe some two player packs or whatever, I don't know. Just let let me know um, throughout the week or whatever, whatever you want to see because I want to like get something going as a little schedule so you know what's happening each day. I want to obviously make it 99% trading but just a little bit different every now and again like weekly rewards or whatever, I don't know. Just let me know obviously and I can sort that out. But yeah, getting into the video now, the fifth method for me guys is still the same method. Like well, It's not a order really but the same method is the specials like the sniping one. There's a new team of the week as well. I'm not too sure who's in it. I'm going to check the team of the week real quick now. I haven't even checked. I've just seen Bale a minute ago and a couple of others. Um, oh, it's the old team of the week. Um, hopefully it's changing here. Of course it hasn't. Great. So, I no idea what the team of the week is, but yeah, there might be some silvers. There might not be, but um, you'll see here 8.1k. 8.3k is going right. So, if we go for 7.5 and just try and snipe any special card that comes up, so any silver can come up here. Of course, I don't think there's any bronze in form this year yet or maybe not at all this year, they seem to bring out silvers every time. This is a really good method obviously when there's a few silvers in the team of the week, a bit later on into the week or whatever when more packs have been opened, it's a really really handy method. Obviously sometimes this also works like 11k when they need an SPC for an inform, these players actually fly up obviously and you can get some gold snipes going or whatever as well. This is the number one method guys, like there's going to be no order in these so make sure like you check them all out because there's no particular order as to which one is best. But that's all you want to do, I mean it's probably dead right now at the end six and people own into the week packs, people aren't going to be obviously listing the stuff, they're going to be more buying and getting team of the week silver players obviously from this team of the week but um, this is going to be special and BPL, it's a similar kind of thing, I think these go for around 15k something like that, might be a little bit less, they are a little bit less than that, maybe 14 then something like that, 14.5 uh, we'll go with, 14.5 um, we can sell them on for, so we're going to try and set up Snipe players for 13k here, so any VPL inform can really come up one to watch. Any of the lower stand up, obviously, like Pogba inform can't come up and stuff like that, but obviously, it probably wouldn't anyway. But yes, yeah, so all you want to do is actually just snipe and like this. Obviously, these are the two higher budget methods, we'll do some cheaper ones after, so don't worry about that. If you don't have these kind of coins and just have some low coins, I will help you out in a second. So make sure you stick around for that, guys. And also, if you're new around here, feel free to drop a sub so close to 6k now the growth hasn't been as great recently but regardless we're still moving on up there I can't really stream right now really really busy but obviously as team of the year comes along I'll try and stream each night and we can obviously grow the channel a little bit more hopefully but yeah I'm struggling for time at the moment that's all I'm doing my best as I can to get videos out every day and we're trying to go on a streak now from uh, the rest of this year up until the end of FIFA like I'll try and get a video out every day or at least six videos every single week but yeah, you see there, um, 14 5, nothing really coming up right now, but you kind of get the gist as to what's happening. Obviously, I'll show you here what can come up. You've seen this video, if you like, obviously from my channel before, you've seen this um, method a million times. But obviously, screen cards, any of these kind of players can come up. Like, there's so many different things that can come up, like Bachiwai or Nautovich, millions of things. Like, even Sterling could pop up. If you're so lucky, a Sterling could pop up. The next one's going to be the Hunter method now, guys. Obviously, you may have seen this one before but it's I need to like recap it because it's so so good like for those lower coins say you're pretty low on coins I mean 2k here for these we check gold players I think they're 2-1 right now so obviously that tells you it's might you might as well just snipe any because um 
a look of 1.8, there's nothing else. So we might go to 1.7 and just sell anything on for 1.9 or 2.1, obviously, if it's gold. So there's always profit to be made here. Obviously, anything could come up here, really, with a low value. That Honda card adds, like, a massive value to it, obviously, like, 2K or whatever, because... Obviously, people want them in a hunter. It's the best cam style to have on your attacking players. So this is a really handy one. These deep up quite frequently. That like I can't promise one will come up, but I'm pretty like confident the one will come up. But we'll soon find out anyway. Obviously, but um, yeah, I've had a lot of different met deals on this method once again. It's just hard doing this live. I did it for two minutes each method. Obviously, you're gonna try these for yourself, and I guarantee you that if you do it for five ten minutes, you'll make some nice profit. But yeah, this is the next one anyway. Um, Obviously, with the hunter method in here like this, just searching on the market. Obviously, going through, hoping for a deal. You can obviously go to like two one, and then just go into here and just refresh it this way. See if anything comes up for that kind of price. But uh, there's not been a great deal on the market, but it looks a bit only two golds. But you just got to think when people are selling the teams and where it's a really good time to do it at like the end of weekend league, say something like that. Of course, because people are also selling the teams. A lot of people put chem styles on them, obviously, to use the players to make them the best they can be, and that obviously will boost their value. But yeah, nothing really coming up here. I can't really do it for much longer. But you see a two-two as well. There's quite a lot of different ones up here. I mean, Josh King, you can sometimes just search through and look for deals. The next method is going to be the converter method. Now, guys, I promise you I'll find the deal on this method. We do obviously go through the chem styles and cam and center mid to look for converter players at 1.9k. So right now, we're looking for strikers in cam. Then we're going into center mid to look for like CDMs, even strikers in center mid as well. And you'd be surprised how many do get listed. Obviously, we want to be attacking chem styles on anything. If you have time, you can't go through every single chem style. I'm going to go through the attacking ones to try and find a deal and hopefully I can find one. This is the fourth method. Of course, now this video should be out around seven ish, something like that, obviously. But it's looking through here now. Fakir, there, not one, no deals there once again. But there's a few camps, I think there's five or six to go through. So I hold hope that there will be a deal. But um, once again, just looking through for a striker now. Adam Maher, I'm sure this guy is a cam, yeah. He used to be gold, I think, so he's actually gone down right now. I'm sure he's pretty young. But um, Steve Cook there isn't one. This guy might be. No, his shot probably gave that one away, to be honest. I don't know why I even checked him. Uh, then we're going to send him in, obviously, and have another look here. And um, just have a little look through and hopefully try and see one. Let me know if I do miss a converted player, guys, well in the comments. That always does annoy me when you, you guys see one and I don't. But um, yeah, Marksman next here. Hopefully, going to try and find one into here. But Lamina, um, nothing there either. This is not looking good, actually. I'm quite surprised how dead. I think with Team of the Year, it was getting really difficult to trade because people just aren't. Everyone sold the stuff and they're just waiting for Team of the Year. That's People don't dare buy stuff now, whatever. They don't want to lose coins. But um end of the day, I'd still recommend trading. If you can find deals and do it, the market is very poor today. I'm not going to lie. Uh, Santos here is a cam as well. Sabitza is normally a cam. But another thing with this method that is beneficial is you can obviously look for players by doing this. Like obviously, say you want to now go and check like Sal. You can go to him like an any chem style. Obviously, there's still that potential to be an any player with the chem style. I'm going to go through the uh, CDMs now real quick, of course. But let's hope you try and find a deal. But nothing there, I don't think. And Diddy and Fellaini are sure CDMs. Um, when Yamakok, I thought that was Yuru for a second. I got excited. But... No, um, it's pretty dead if you look, ask me, like, there's not a lot up, like, 750 for this guy, normally a CDM, all those players usually CDM, uh, pretty frustrating, if you went through the other chem styles, you may find something, but right now it just doesn't really look promising at all, really, um, we'll just check, like, Maestro or something in CDM, see if there's any cams up, I mean, I'm just going to look for cams now, obviously, not strikers, I mean, strikers may still come up, but... You want to look for your cams, and Hector there is normally a CDM, but yeah, guys, no deals there either. The final method is the one that always works. Um, I'm gonna get Silver League, and if you look here, I have 300 coins, there's two deals here that's a goalkeeper. So if we get to 400, you'll see every single player here is pretty much a goalkeeper, bar a couple. So what you can do now is you can go and buy these for 400, say, like that. And I think there's another one here, I believe, this Blin. I mean, he didn't really sell for much more. But you can still do it with him. You can just list these up for, like, 550 each because people will just go and pick these up off the market. It's a really good way of doing it, like, 500 or whatever, and then 500 on this guy as well. These will sell on. And then we want to pretty much be doing the 300 coins one or 350. We'll just check out 350 how many there actually is. 
um, there is quite a few but once again you'll see 350 you can buy it if you want to but what I'd recommend that wait a minute actually this might be a deal no 450 there you can just refresh it like this and obviously pick these up for 300 and sell them on for 400 straight away pretty much so it's always a handy little thing to do We'll obviously go on to that one on now. This is the best method for me really recently. But I don't know how well it's working now. These players have dropped a bit. I was selling them for 550 at one point. They have started to drop like everything else. But um Yeah, we'll soon find out just how well this does work. Uh, pretty unfortunate the market is dropping like this, guys. Hopefully you can still trade with some of these methods. I mean I've been using them since the start of FIFA and they have all worked, they don't let me down too much. Another thing to do is go in like Defender and the or like through certain teams even like Amonies, yeah, I think these are pretty expensive, maybe like one K, something like that, you'll see. Yeah, maybe it's not actually Amnes, it's I think Angers that's expensive. Um, no, it was Amnes, never mind. And then they have dropped as well. I mean I did this Cavani and it, these are all expensive now, suddenly they're not, which is pretty annoying. 400 coins there, we can sell that one for 700, but you see there, just going through them like this does get you deals. Yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. If you have, please do drop a like. I probably not getting many deals, but you still have the methods there if you wish to try them. And trust me, they do work. Like, I'm not lying to you. You've obviously seen them before on stream. If you don't want to do it, guys, just wait till I stream again and I'll do them after you can ask me to do them. And all that good stuff. So make sure you drop a like if you're um, enjoying the video. Uh, sub if you're new, and I will see you all next time with another video.